peptides are compounds formed by alpha amino acids linked by peptide bonds. Peptides are widely used in food, medicine, cosmetics and other industries, and peptides can promote bone production and prevent osteoporosis, which is very beneficial to the human body. Peptides can be extracted from plants or animals. The most commonly seen peptides of plant or animal origin are soybean peptide, pea peptide, walnut peptide, fish collagen peptide, sea fish oligopeptide, oyster peptide, and sea cucumber peptide. Soybean peptide refers to the peptide obtained by enzymatic hydrolysis of soybean protein. The oligopeptide, which is mainly composed of 3 to 6 amino acids, can quickly supplement the nitrogen source of the human body, restore physical strength and relieve fatigue. Compared with soybean protein, soybean peptide has the physiological functions of high digestion and absorption, rapid energy supply, lowering cholesterol, lowering blood pressure and promoting fat metabolism, as well as no fishy smell, no protein denaturation, acid non-precipitation, heating and non-solidification, easy to dissolve in water, good fluidity and other good processing properties. It is an excellent material for health food. Pea peptide is an active small molecule peptide, it is extracted from pea protein by biocomplex enzyme digestion. Pea peptides contain 8 amino acids that the human body cannot synthesize on its own, and the proportion of them is close to the recommended model of FAOWHO. Through the functional experiments of pea peptides, the researchers found that pea peptides have better solubility, water retention, oil absorption, foaming, emulsification, gel, and so on than pea protein. Because of these good efficacies and excellent functional properties, pea peptides are widely used in food and health products. Walnut peptide is a small molecular peptide extracted from walnut protein by advanced directional enzyme digestion and low temperature membrane separation technology. It is rich in eight kinds of essential amino acids and is a new type of nutrient. Walnut peptide has good nutritional properties and is a promising and safe functional food raw material. Walnut peptide is an important substance to repair brain cell metabolism, which can nourish brain cells, enhance brain function, supplement cardiomyocytes, purify blood, lower cholesterol and purify blood vessels, so as to provide better fresh blood for the human body. Fish collagen peptide also known as marine collagen peptide, is a health ingredient made from fish and is made up of mostly type I collagen. Fish collagen peptide is characterized by its specific amino acid composition, with a high concentration of glycine and proline. These amino acids have functional and nutritional properties regarding health, wellness and beauty. Fish collagen peptide has moisturizing and beautifying effects on the skin. It is of great benefit in preventing skin aging and wrinkles. It can also promote blood circulation and reduce fine lines. Marine fish oligopeptide is a deep processed product of deep sea type high collagen peptide which is mainly extracted from codfish skin consisting of 26 amino acids with a molecular weight of 500 to 1000 Dalton. Marine fish oligopeptide can be absorbed directly by the small intestine, human skin, and it has strong nutritional characteristics and wide applications such as in food, health care pharmaceuticals and cosmetics industries, etc. The peptides, which are present in the inactive form within the protein chains, are activated after their hydrolysis using enzymes, including trypsin, proteinases, chymotrypsin, alkylase, and pepsin. Depending on their structures and amino acid sequences, marine fish proteins and peptides exhibit a wide range of biological activities including antioxidant, antimicrobial, anti-cancer effects and other effects. Oyster peptide is a small molecular collagen peptide extracted from fresh oyster or natural dried oyster by special pretreatment and targeted bioenzyme digestion technology at low temperature. Oyster peptide contains the trace elements, ZN, SE, etc., oyster polysaccharides and taurine. It is widely used in food, pharmaceuticals and healthcare products. Oyster peptides are not only rich in protein, vitamins, trace elements with appropriate proportion and taurine but also contain a variety of nutrients that are unique to marine organisms. And numerous clinical data confirm that oyster can improve the level of testosterone in male serum, regulate blood lipid, inhibit platelet aggregation, improve the symptoms of hyperglycemia, improve immunity, protect liver, and promote metabolism. Sea cucumber contains more than 50 natural nutrients. 
Sea cucumber peptide is a small molecule peptide extracted from fresh or dried sea cucumber by advanced enzyme hydrolysis technology. This technology is preferred in the food industry to produce bioactive peptides, facilitating the release of polysaccharides varying in molecular weight and chemical structure in commercial sea cucumber species and increasing the viscosity of sea cucumber hydrolysate. By advanced enzyme hydrolysis technology, sea cucumber large proteins molecules can be transformed into small molecule peptides which are more easily absorbed and have stronger functions such as anti-aging, anti-fatigue, anti-tumor effect, etc. The high potency, specificity and good safety profile are the main strengths of peptides as new and promising therapies that may fill the gap between small molecules and protein drugs. Peptides possess favorable tissue penetration and the capability to engage into specific and high affinity interactions with endogenous receptors. Thus, in recent years, peptides have received increased interest in pharmaceutical, food, cosmetics and various other fields. Polypeptide drugs have the advantages of small molecular weight, high activity, stable curative effect, less toxic and side effects, less dosage, no immunogenicity and strong specificity. Some cardiovascular and metabolic diseases have significant curative effects and broad application prospects. At present, many peptide drugs such as Kong, oxytocin, and somatostatin have been marketed. Most peptide drugs are derived from endogenous peptides or other natural peptides so their structures and mechanisms of action are relatively clear, and the products have high purity and controllable quality. In recent years, the hotspots of peptide drug research mainly focus on the following aspects. As a drug carrier or prodrug, the polypeptide is used as a drug carrier or prodrug in the body to adsorb and load the target drug on the carrier, and use the polypeptide to modify the drug carrier which broadens the scope of application of the polypeptide in the field of medicine. As a therapeutic polypeptide, the commonly used methods of administration of polypeptides as therapeutic drugs are injection and non-injection administration. Since the stability of polypeptide drugs is easily affected by temperature, pH, etc., the stability is poor and they are easily degraded in the body. The dosage form is injection. The polypeptide can also be used as preparations such as oral dosage forms and spray dosage forms. Since polypeptides have a variety of physiological activities, they can be used as drugs for the prevention and treatment of various diseases, such as anti-tumor, antivirus, high polypidemic, antibacterial, etc. Peptides are mainly used in functional foods and food additives in the food industry. Peptides are easy to digest and absorb, and have various physiological activities such as anti-obesity, antibacterial, antivirus, anti-hypertensive, lipid-lowering, physical fitness enhancement, anti-fatigue, and promotion of mineral absorption. And the viscosity changes slowly with the concentration, etc., and it is easy to be added to various foods as a functional factor. For example, baby food, diet food, functional food, food additives. In addition to the above uses, Peptides can also be used as food sensory peptides, such as sour peptides, sweet peptides, flavor peptides, and surface active peptides, in various fields of food, so the market potential of peptides in the food field is huge. Peptides play an important role in the growth, development and metabolism of organisms. In the process of natural skin aging and care, small molecule active peptides play an important role, such as cell migration, reproduction, inflammation angiogenesis, pigmentation, and formation and regulation of protein synthesis. The main functions of peptides and cosmetics are, promote the metabolism of cells, it can promote and maintain the normal metabolism of cells, and then promote the regeneration of skin cells, making the skin look like new. Activate cell activity, peptides can effectively remove free radicals harmful to the human body by activating cell activity, reduce the accumulation of spots, make the skin fair and bright and achieve the purpose of delaying aging. Inhibit cell degeneration. Peptides can effectively inhibit cell degeneration, enhance the body's immunity, thereby reducing the loss of skin collagen, improving skin relaxation, and enhancing skin cells' water holding and moisturizing ability. Repair damaged cells. Peptides can repair damaged skin cells, improve cell metabolism, thereby reducing skin oxidation, making skin wrinkles lighter and lighter and ultimately achieving the effect of restoring youth and anti-aging. Peptides are organic substances that make up various connective tissues, and can help the rapid synthesis of elastin and collagen. Peptides can prevent the formation of skin wrinkles. 
peptides can accelerate the penetration of collagen into the surface of the skin and be fully absorbed by the skin to act as a natural moisturizing factor and fill between the skin matrix to increase the tension of the skin and maintain smoothness, plumpness, and elasticity. Peptide can pave the way for the migration and proliferation of epidermal cells, provide good nutrition, promote the growth of skin and nerves, and facilitate the proliferation and repair of epithelial cells, thus promoting the healing of wound surfaces.